For our next meal, we're gonna do a cheesy chicken casserole. This is one of the chicken breasts that I had. I'm gonna shred it with a fork. You just kinda pull it apart with a fork and shred it. That's pretty good. So we're gonna saute some onions and bell peppers. Because the chicken is done, the noodles are done, we have a taco season pack, we've got one cup of sour cream, and we have cheese. So everything is really kinda done except for the vegetables. So we need to saute these until they become translucent. So this recipe calls for garlic. I'm not gonna chop up cloves. I usually buy garlic already minced and it'll last me. This jar will last me for months. Add a little bit to it. I'm gonna add it in last because garlic has a tendency to burn. Okay. Dry. The peppers and onions. I've got one pack of taco seasoning mix. I'm going to add that. And one cup of sour cream. And of course, your shredded chicken. Give this a good stir, mix it all in. I'm gonna cheat a little bit. It says to put the cheese only on the top, but I'm gonna put a little bit inside. I like my casserole cheesy, so I'm gonna add a little bit on the inside. Now this goes into a grease casserole dish, so if you don't have a pan spray, just take a paper towel, dip it in your oil, and just oil your pan. Good. So it's easier to come out when you serve it, and that's it. We're not gonna complicate this. And this goes into our dish. Ooh. Almost made too much to fit in this dish, but we're gonna get it in here. There we go. Mash it down a little. That's good. And then we're gonna cover it with cheese. More cheese. <laughs> We're gonna bake it on 350 until the cheese is bubbly. So all you're really doing now is melting the cheese and making sure everything is warm. And it goes into a 350 oven. And pause it. We're gonna spoon this on the plate. And we're gonna serve this with a nice garden salad, something light, because you've got a lot of starch and cheese, so something nice and clean and refreshing.